and the relative humidity was 87%. The wind was south at 10 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.80 inches and steady. Elsewhere around the region, a thunderstorm was reported with a temperature of 73 at Midway Airport and 73 at Gary, Indiana. It was cloudy with a temperature of 65 at Milwaukee Airport, 67 at Waukegan, Gun, 72 at DuPage Airport, and 74 at Benton Harbor. Once again, at O'Hara Airport it was 73 under cloudy skies. At the Kenosha Harbor entrance, winds were north at 3 knots. At Chicago's Harrison Creek, winds were south at 13 knots. In open waters, at the South Lake Michigan buoy, winds were north at 4 knots. Waves were 1 foot in open waters. At the North Lake Michigan buoy, winds reached at 6 knots. Waves were 1 foot. Here is the forecast for the Chicago metropolitan area. Flash flood watch in effect from 7 p.m. This evening through Saturday morning. Tonight, showers and thunderstorms in the evening, then showers and a chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Some thunderstorms may produce heavy rainfall in the evening. Lows in the lower 60s. Southeast winds 5 to 10 miles per hour in the evening becoming west and increasing to 10 to 20 miles per hour with gusts up to 30 miles per hour after midnight. Chance of precipitation 80%. Saturday, mostly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers early in the morning, then partly cloudy in the Oh, we are after the storm. It's kind of still raining a little bit. <clears throat> I'm still calling for severe thunderstorms, though. Alright. Oh. It's the weather. Always oh, kind of humid today. It's still raining out. It drops on me. The ground is wet. Don't see any thunder or any lightning as of right now, but it's really windy. We'll see what happens later on. This is the end of it, or if we get more.